It's so hard to keep trusting God when you can't understand what is going on. When you feel he is forgetting you, when you feel alone, when you feel overlooked, when you feel like you have ended up being collected damage in some situation, when you feel something is unfair, when you feel betrayed, when you feel like faithfulness is overrated when you feel obedience is too much like hard work, our lives will be a praise to God, which will be grateful have a smile be, good to people and be passionate about our dream. When you have learned the secret to bless the Lord at all times you can be, in a pit, but nobody around you know it. You are not sure you don't have a chip on your shoulder. When you feel you have been let down, again when you feel it's never going to, happen when you feel you will never get a second chance or third, when you have no accident to get back up. After you have hit the window, get out of your cell again, I know it's hard. But please remember that faith is predicted on trust, not understanding, I know you don't get it right now, but hang in there. A prayer for today. Father, thank you that you are worth of my worship and praise. Together I am on the mountain top or in the valley, my whole life can be a place to you. Help me to learn the secret of blessing you at all times. God is with you and for you he is good and does good is not over. Praying for our miracle working God to touch our life today. Efficiency verse 20 so as he is able to do far more than we can ask or imagine. Both in us and through us he can heal, save, deliver, restore and redeem. Anyone can give God praise when things are going your way but the test is will. You praise him in the wilderness. Will you worship in spite of what's not working in spite of who did you wrong? The way you bless the Lord at all the time is by your place by always finding something to be grateful for by not dwelling on wrongs but thanking God for what's right. Because of this faith is what enemy went. To take from you without it you won't be able to move from the fact of your circumstances to the truth of God's promises. But when you trust God when you believe, his promises when you walk by faith you can see the self-efficiency verse 20 in your life. It's by not focusing on what you lost, but thanking God for what you have lived and by not complaining about what's behind you but by being grateful for what's in front of you. Now all glory to God who is able to, through his mighty power at work within, us to accomplish infinitely more than we might ask or think. God bless you.